Welcome back. We are here on Ether looking at the cryptocurrency market. And this is going to be my daily forecast for Friday, November 20th, 2020. If you'd like to support our channel, you're welcome to hit the subscribe button down here in the corner, hit the like button and the bell button in order to see our newest videos. And if you want our full technical analysis, you can click the Patreon link down below and you also get access to our live trading and courses if you would like. So at this point, we are looking at the Bitcoin. And Bitcoin has been rallying quite significantly. Yesterday, we got all the way up to 18,000, nearly 18,500. And Bitcoin hasn't been this high since 2017. You can go to the weekly chart in order to see this, because this was the uh, past rally of Bitcoin. But Bitcoin was basically, uh, well, everything. Everybody was talking about Bitcoin. Everybody was investing in Bitcoin, and it became a massive bubble which burst up here at around 20,000. Now, Bitcoin, for uh, whatever reason, probably because people are buying this as a safe haven, similar to gold, for example, when economic conditions are not looking good, they're looking at uh, another uh, value, um, for example, another currency, that they can basically invest into, basically to save their um, or protect their investment or the value. And usually it happens to be gold, but at this point, it looks like what people are putting their money into is basically Bitcoin. So the, mo the exciting thing here is what will happen if we get to this level. My guess is that we probably will see something similar to this. It won't be as drastic. This was just a massive bubble uh, in Bitcoin. Um, this has been a more gradual uh, increase, but this is very parabolic. We'll have a major fall from here. It probably won't be as drastic as this because we fell from 20,000 all the way down to 3,000. But if you look at the Fibonacci retracements here, if you take the very lows here and we say that Bitcoin is going to go to the 20,000, then we can see that the first area that we'll run into in the Fibonacci retracement is around 13,857. That's the first one. Next one is here. And that is where I guess that Bitcoin will fall to. That is around 12,000 before we turn around again and rally. So... If we rally all the way up to 20,000, this is a very realistic scenario that will fall from 20,000 and gradual decline or a massive decline all the way down towards 12,000 before we uh, meet up with the 50 moving average or the 200 moving average and then rally again, where is something similar to something like this. So that is to be seen, but at this point, it is not a good idea to buy here. That is absolutely ridiculous. Bitcoin is significantly overbought. Technically, in the Guinness, these two are turning around, the CCI and the Stochastic, but not the MACD. MACD is very bullish at this point, but the CCI, for example, moves faster than these indicators. So if this, um, this warn is showing signs of weakness or turning around, then that is an indication that we are going to go lower. So this is the weekly chart. So if you look at the daily chart, it is even more bearish in here, in this, uh, this chart. So... Um, well, this is going to be exciting because if we manage to get to 20,000, if we get a very weak candlestick at 20,000, then I will definitely be a seller in this market and I will target around 12,000. Um, so it is to be seen at the moment. It's just fun to see how parabolical Bitcoin is at this point. So you look at each room, we can see that we have been really choppy here. And what I expect uh, to happen here is uh, basically a fall towards the 50 moving average. We hit, uh, we hit the highs yesterday. We actually exceeded the highs, the previous highs over here uh, yesterday, but we have pulled back. And at this point, if you look at the technical indicators, there is, it is technically inevitable that we'll head towards the uh, 50 moving average and then rally again. So we are in uptrend. There's no reason to to uh, to short this. It's basically just wait until we get as close to the 50 as possible in order to buy it to the upside. So hope you find this video helpful. You're welcome to subscribe to our channel by clicking the subscribe button down in the corner. 
hit the like button, the bell button in order to see our newest videos. And you're welcome to join us over at Patreon, where we all now nearly have 90 traders active on our Patreon account using our signal service and also our live streams and so on and so on. So good luck again. Thank you very much. Thank you.